hope you have finished with the first drawing let's go for the next drawing okay as usual before you start analyze the drawing now it looks like there are a lot of things happening in this drawing but i'll try to break it down for you it's going to be very simple now you can see that the total height from here to here is 80 millimeters and the total length is only 110 millimeters so it means that if i am able to draw a box like this and then if i mark 40 millimeters from here i can draw a straight line like this and if i mark 30 millimeters from this point i can draw a straight line like this and then they have told that from this end till this end is 50 millimeters so i can draw a straight line like this and after that all i have to do is i have to erase all the unwanted lines like this these are all the unwanted lines that i need i don't want so i'm just erasing it then i'll take the template and i'll take this says 15 millimeters is the radius which means that this particular circle is a circle of diameter 30 so what i'll do is i'll take my circle template and then i'm going to align it in this position and then i'll go i'll draw an arc like this an arc like this again i'll have two arcs and then i'm going to delete all the unwanted lines now if you don't have the um, circle template you can of course draw a circle here a complete circle and then you can erase it okay let's start drawing that's the planning i have done i'm going to keep the ipad aside for my reference right for you guys i'll try to put the drawing somewhere in this portion of the video so as i draw you can see fine let's start drawing now always start with the horizontal so the horizontal they say the horizontal box is 110 so I'm going to draw a line of 110 which is nothing but 11 millimeters 11 centimeters and the height is going to be 8 so I have 8 here so I'm going to draw this again 110 millimeters Keep it straight okay let me mark the 8 here so this is where the 8 has to come so i know the okay so that now i am keeping my ruler straight so this is the first construction these are the construction line now with this i am going to do it and as i told you from the bottom here i have to mark 40 millimeters and then I'll mark another 30 millimeters. I'll do the same thing here also so that the lines are going to be straight. 40 millimeters. And after that, I'm going to make a dot for 30 millimeters. Then let me join it. That's a straight line. And there goes another straight line, a vertical line. Then from this edge i am going to make 50 millimeters or 5 centimeters same thing here 50 millimeters or 5 centimeters join the two dots now i have it something like this now what i don't want is this look at this i have erased it so whatever i don't want i'm just erasing it of course this line is also not necessary now in case you have a um, circle template like this you can align it in this fashion exactly in between okay fair enough and then i am going to draw the arc 
same thing here align it to the lines and then draw the arc in case you don't have this one what do you do we will have to use the compass now i'll show you how to use the compass in the other end the radius is 1.5 isn't it so i'll use the same thing here i'll mark 1.5 here and i'll mark 1.5 this side and then i'm going to draw a square like this straight okay and then you can have your compass 1.5 and then draw a same thing has to be done here also I'm going to draw 1.5 and then another 1.5 I'll mark here and I'll draw it like this so that is going to be my center take the compass radius 1.5 and then I'll make a circle like this. Like this. That's it. Now I will draw all the con all the object lines dark. Now I'm not using a HB or 2, uh, uh, 2B or uh, 2H. All I'm using is a HB pencil. See? So if I press, it becomes darker. And if I don't press, then it becomes lighter. So we'll just make everything dark. Always draw the construction lines lighter. Only then it is easy for you to erase it if you don't need it. Okay, there you go. That's our drawing. So I'm going to erase all the construction lines. I don't want construction lines. Right. That's it. So done with all the drawings. So totally, if we have two drawings on A3, and then we have done two drawings on A4. So that completes our module one activities.